Welcome. So what I'd like to do is be able to explain to you what is the difference between a concave and a convex polygon. And this become very important as we start solving uh, problems involving polygons that a lot of times we're going to make sure we're going to need to have only convex polygons. So what exactly is the difference? Well, let me kind of draw two polygons here. Um, that's not the way I wanted to do it. OK, so you got one that looks like this. And then you have one that looks like this. So you can see, um, and that's, they should have connected, right? And they connect at their vertices. OK, so one thing we, there's a, a way that we can determine if it's convex or uh, concave. But one thing you can kind of notice about these is, you know, all these vertices are kind of all out, where um, this one, you can see this vertice is kind of like pointed back in um, in the polygon. And that's exactly the, pretty much the definition that we look to. When we have a convex, all right, um, the way that we can determine a convex is simply just extending all of the sides of a convex polygon. And when I extend all of the sides of the convex polygon, you, you see that none of the sides intersect um, in the interior of our polygon. Therefore, it's convex. However, when I do this with this concave polygon, what we notice is now the sides intersect when I extend them inside of the polygon. So this is what we call concave. And that's basically the understanding you can see, you know, think about as a cave, you're kind of caving in to the polygon. And that's going to be your basic way to be able to determine which um, one is which. And then we'll get into further in the course of exactly our uh, example of you know, how to determine between one or, uh, one or the other, as well as you know, how we can use each one to be able to solve problems. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is your basic difference between concave and convex polygons. Thanks.